I don't know what to do right now. I'm literally so depressed right now. I have no idea how I went from being like happy to like being oh my god. I miss school. And I really miss my friends a lot, to be fair. If any of you guys are watching this and you go with me to, I mean, went with me to Pulaski, I miss you so much. So, the first part. I looked on one of my friend's snaps and I realized that I wonder why people don't talk about me. Like, I want my voice to be heard by anybody. I don't care who it is. Well, as long as I know them. Okay? If anybody knows me, I want my this video to be seen. Okay? Some of you might know that I have a bit of a hard time getting into conversations with people. Which is why if you start a conversation with me and you're not waiting for me to speak, you know I'll just stare at you until you say your line because I'm too shy, okay? I get anxiety, like social anxiety. So, that is the main reason why I'm so different. I'm shy. I have autism. I can't talk to people as much as I used to. Like, back in elementary, I was literally the most popular kid in the whole entire school. Let's face it. I was literally popular for winning the spelling bee. I was popular for being smart. I was popular for knowing a lot about cars. But now, since I'm and since I was in middle school, I'm no longer popular about that now. Instead, I was friends with my classmates, of course. I mean, some of my friends from elementary became my friends in middle school. Yeah, I can see that working out already. I already lost my third best friend. Now I have no nothing. Mm. I have already been depressed for m many, many days. Okay. I have been so sad for the past three months, ever since he went out of middle school, graduation. Boy, did that make me cry that night. Oh god, I'm still thinking about it. Okay, trying to calm down. And now that I'm figuring out that I am at home, I'm no longer talking. People are no longer talking to me. I'm no longer talking to people. I'm literally just the person who's a nobody right now. Like, in middle school, in 8th grade, I was the life of the party. Well, not technically. I was more like the funny kid. 
who did weird voices. You probably, but some of you are probably out of state. You guys don't have those in your, those type of people in your schools. But I uh, was that kid, that kid who was weird and funny and was also kind of smart. Unfortunately, that had a bit of a side effect. Me being the shy person I was, because starting in sixth grade, I lost all of my friends, and then I became shy, just like I was in kindergarten. And this continued all the way through eighth grade, seventh grade, and sixth grade. So I have, I'll just be like miserable as hell, cause, I don't know, I guess I'm not getting as much attention, but that's kind of stupid, that's, that's kind of stupid, but I want to be heard, I want to be the person who's, how do you say it, the person who's, let me say popular. I want to be the person who everybody talks about. But I can't do that yet because I'm still starting off my YouTube channel. Which is kind of disappointing if you think about it. And ever since that fateful day... Now I have to go into one of the world's, one of the state's biggest high schools, and I'm probably going to end up being lost all the time, and I'm going to have trouble making new friends, I'm probably going to have to go with people, people go their separate ways in middle school. I just find it unfair. Some some of my friends might still be in high in the same high school as me, but I won't be in their classes. So that's kind of horrible. Plus, they might not even acknowledge me at all. I guess I'm great. I had many friends that I had in eighth grade. People treat me with respect, and now in eighth grade. People love to just freaking make me upset. They just love torturing autistic people. It's kind of stupid. And if you ask me, I had enough of it. And... I'm going to end up starting making up a list of, like, one of the most horrible things of high school. One, you have big tests. Two, you will never get to see any of your friends in your classes. Well, some of them. But that's not like the case. Three, you get lots of homework. Boy, in middle school, they were letting you off, okay? They weren't giving you as much homework in eighth grade. But now in ninth grade, they're going to give you twice as much homework. Four, you're going to have to study for hours. And finally, number five. It, my high school's pretty big, so if your high school's pretty big, you're going to end up getting lost all the time, no matter what. You're going to end up always being late. This long pause was brought to you by my anxiety. I had an anxiety attack just now.
Anyway. I can't continue on this video. It's making me have anxiety attacks, making me feel more sad. I can't continue this video anymore. So I'll just see you guys in the next one. I'll be too lazy to edit this to cut out the long pauses, but that leaves me becoming a liar. So I'm just going to leave this out and cut.